Hello everyone, I'm your host, Boss Zombie. Welcome back to Link's Awakening. Dompe stuff is... Oop, that's not what I wanted. Actually, that is what I wanted. Dompe stuff is done. Uh, now... I, I had an idea. Instead of getting all the heart pieces and shells I'm missing off screen... Or, off screen... I looked up a map of just, like... This... And looked at the ones I was missing and then marked those. So I'm gonna go get those. Also, there's one here that... Who knew? Um... Apparently there's one right here that I didn't know about. Wait, not here. What? Is there another thing in here? Alright, get out of here. There is another thing in here. Oh. Wow, I totally missed that. I should have figured, too, because there's so much empty space up here. Would you look at that? I wonder how obvious these ones I missed are. Uh, okay, so... Then there's... Oh, this one. So that one I actually saw while I was playing off screen. I guess a consequence of not going to Dompe that often is that I didn't uh wait how do you get out I guess you just got it a long way um since I never went to his hut that often I never really looked around the area there's a heart piece literally visible from his hut like if you walk in out the door you can see it So how many, how many things did the Frog Song of Soul work on? It was the remains of the chicken and Turtle Rock, right? Look, you walk out the door, right there. There's a heart piece right under that crow. I don't know how I didn't ever, how I never looked there. There it is. Foolish. Uh, let's see, that one... What is the fastest way to get into the water there? You can't go from there. I could go from there. I think. It was even... Even this is something I said, oh, I should check that out. And I never really did. Just swimming around in the water. Because apparently there's a heart piece and two shells there. Two or three shells. Two or three. Oh, and there's a thing here that I don't know how I missed either, but... Get those in due time. Swim, Link, swim. I'm curious about these, though, because these I... I never went to this area, so are they under the water? That's Mambo. No. Oh, it's not here. Oh, is it, a, is it in the waterfall? Like, is it a cave in the waterfall? Oh, yeah. It's not in the waterfall, but it's underneath it. I should have explored the moat. Where is it? It's at the corner. Huh. 
Huh, there's a hook shot. Alright. Oh, but there's a heart piece. Oh, and that's the last heart piece. That's... I guess you could have kind of seen that from... If you, like, cross over the bridge. But that's... That one's a little more hidden. I think I can excuse myself for missing that one. I'm excited to see what is and isn't reused with Echoes of Wisdom. Same engine, right? And a ton of the enemies are... Like, I imagine all the Mario styled enemies aren't going to be in it. We probably won't see uh, cheap cheeps and bloopers and all that. But, I mean, Moblins this, this, of this design, I could see. Actually, they've shown Moblins in the trailer. I don't remember if they used this design. Did they show Moblins or did they show something else? I think they did. Take the little acorn. Oh, yeah. That's a little easy to miss, too, but I would need the hook shot and a whole bunch of factors. Okay. I gotta go back towards the face. Not the face, the southern ruins. Is that what they were called? Uh, what's the easiest, I guess, from here. Actually, oh, I can't. I can't go. I'd have to jump in the moat and swim all the way back around. I'll pass. I love that the mirror shield reflects projectiles and not just magic. Oh, and it hits. The boomerang hits these annoying things. Give me that fairy. Wait. If you kill those things with the boomerang, they become a fairy? What an interesting quirk. Also, I'd love to know what these things are actually called. Oh, I know that the River Zoras are in uh, Echoes. I've seen them, but they also have Ocean Zoras, which... How many games have had both in them? This has to be at least one other one. Maybe one of the Oracle games? Is there really one here? Oh, the boomerang even works on Armos? Wow. It doesn't even matter if they're blocking with their shield. Wow. where that annoying boss was that I could not figure out the mechanic. I could pick them up? Wait. Huh. Oh. It was standing on top of stairs. That's why my little sensor didn't go off. That's... If this is just a room with a seashell, that sensor should be activated, right? That seems a little too quirky. But again, it's a case of, hey, this seems like it's a dead end. There should be something here. That's a, that's a pretty common thing in Zelda games. There's no real dead ends. Even if it's a, like, collectible or something, there's usually something.
Uh, so, oh, I know there's 14 stones in total. And as a consequence of looking those up, I know where they are. One of them is from... Oh, I'm sorry. That's the first time I hit an animal. I don't like that. Um, I know you get one for getting all the shells. And then... I think the other one is for getting every figurine from the... The crane game? The trendy game? Oh, yeah! Lone tree! Lone suspicious tree! Yep. I think that's the last one. 50? 50. It's a little... I mean, I guess it makes sense. This is like the extra credit is finding every single one. But at the same time, I kind of wish it was like something cooler. Like... I don't know, like golden arrows or something. That's a... That's a... These a common enough upgrade in Zelda games. Or light arrows, golden arrows, whichever. Depends on your Zelda game. You've discovered every secret. The proof is in the seashells you hold. I acknowledge the perseverance it took. May fortune bless you wherever you roam. My task here is finished. Oh, okay. That's not a bad reward. A bunch of money. That was like 200-ish rupees. Yep. Alright, all that's left is beat the game. And then... One last crane game. It's funny, the Dampe Shack is the closest thing to the last dungeon. Dampe, Guardian of the Egg. Oh, do I still have... How do I... It's... Okay, I still have it. Just making sure. So I don't get there and waste my... Well, I guess I could always just look up the solution, but... I so rarely use the... Photo mode of the Switch. I might as well take advantage of it a few times. Egg. Oh, right. Um... This song actually has a major use now. Oh, let's hear the song. Oh, what does it sound like in HD? nice, but the instrument balance feels a bit off. Some... Some of the instruments are a little too loud. And some of them are too quiet. Because that's how eggs work. Owl? Hey, Owl. The time has come. The windfish awaits. Enter the egg. I guess I should save. I forgot how weird it is here. Okay, I guess this is where it comes into play. So it is... Left, four ups. How do I do a left, though? Okay, so left. Four. Is it random per game? I never thought about that. It might be. 
Oh, but four ups. Okay. One more up. What were the last ones? Right, right up. Okay. Right. Right. Oh, okay. I was expecting to do something wrong somehow. We were born of nightmares. To take over this world, we made the windfish sleep endlessly. If the windfish doesn't wake up, this island will never disappear. We would have been the masters of this place. But you had to come here and disrupt our plans. Heh, <laughs> you can never defeat us. Let's rumble. Ah, yes, the nightmare. Oh, wait, is... Oh, right, it's based on my nightmares. What's first? I don't even remember. Spooky. Oh, is it the... Is this the one that needs the... I think this one needs magic powder. Okay, what's next? Oh, again, again in him, again him. Let me uh. Oh, blue one's bad. Right. I wonder if you can reflect the blue ones. Nope. Bit of an awkward angle. Ah. All right. Now. Oh, it's Moldorn. But like, not as cool Moldorn. He doesn't look like a hamburger. Oh, it's fast. Ooh, Ganon. Uh, is he arrows? I don't remember how Ganon works. I don't remember how Ganon works. Is it dodge the bats? And then he throws the thing. I don't remember how to fight Ganon. Magic rod, maybe? How do you do this? I'm not going to sit here and just do nothing. What? Nightmare. That's how you spell nightmare. Ganon. What's your gimmick and why can't I understand it? Uh, what do you do with this? Use a spin attack or... What? Either can charge the shadow in a dash attack in order to defeat it. What? I imagine only when it's... Only when it's vulnerable. Cool. No, that didn't work.
Oh, okay. I hit him a bunch of times in a row. That's fine. That one sucks. It's the two. Oh. Hey. Oh, boomerang works on this one. <laughs> okay. The two bosses in this game I've had difficulty with that I had to look something up needed a spin attack or a weird mechanic. What is this form called? It's like death or something like that? How many hits, Deathel? I, I think in the original version, the boomerang one hit kills this form. I guess that would be too cheap. You're right, a lot. Oh, the arms are going out of sync. Now, fine, I'll eat the damage. I have the blue tunic. Well, oh, the speed is weird. Count on a rebound. How many hits? There we go. This island is going to disappear. Our world is going to disappear. Our world. Our world. It definitely is the only creature that's not from one of Link's nightmares or memories. I guess that's supposed to be the shadow's true form. Link, you've beaten all the nightmares. Climb the stairs before you. I actually took a lot of damage. That boss is so much harder compared to anything else in the game. Especially if you don't know what you're doing. Like with the Ganon fight and how dumb that one was. It like he uses the same attacks as Link to the Past Ganon, but how you fight back is totally unconnected. Disconnected? Unrelated? Hoosh. Young lad, I mean Link, the hero. You've defeated the nightmares. You have proven your wisdom, courage, and power. As part of the Windfish's spirit, I am the guardian of his dream world. But at one day, the nightmares entered the dream and began wreaking havoc. Then you, Link, came to rescue the island. I've always trusted in your courage. I knew that you could turn back the nightmares. Thank you, Link. My work is done. The windfish will wake soon. Goodbye. Hoot. Oh, you have such a cool design. Why didn't they ever use you again? I am the windfish. Unrelated to Levias, he's a different flying whale. Long has been my slumber. In my dreams, an egg appeared. It was surrounded by an island with people, animals, an entire world. But verily, it be the nature of dreams to end. When I dost awaken, Koholint will be gone. Is there a kind of anagram going on there? It's Link is in there, and then I guess Toho, a Hoto, To, Hoot. Oh, is it Link and Hoot? Like the owl? Is that. I wonder if that's a thing. Only the memory of this dreamland will exist in the waking world. Someday thou may recall this island. That memory makes the dream world real. Come, Link. Let us awaken together. 
Play the eight instruments. Play the song of awakening. Okay, bye, Mr. Big Giant Fish. Hey, look, if that's an intentional thing. All oh, right, the world starts fading away. I don't like this. Oh, you numbskull. Again in the forest, the mushrooms. No, not her. She's the one interesting character in this game. Well, I guess the talking animals are... Ooh. Well, I wonder if there's an anime-esque outro cutscene like there was the intro. Oh, no. No one seems to say it's an anagram intentionally. We do get an anime-esque outro. Right, this was always a weird ending. Like, Link's just stranded in the ocean on a piece of... Flotsam. Flotsam is wrecked. Jetsam is ejected, re ejected from a ship. Oh, singing. Oh, look, he actually did a pretty good job putting a little raft together. Did we get the good ending? Oh! Well, I guess the windfish is not a part of the dream. That one, that thing's real. Hey, could I hit your ride? Because after this, timeline-wise, is the Oracle Games, I think. It goes Link to the Past, Link's Awakening, Oracle Games. Then big time jump, and then Link Between Worlds. Like, this Link is in the most Zelda games. Oh, do we not see... The... Do I not get a Marin cutscene? Or maybe it's a post-credits thing? But yeah, this Link was in... Oh! Oh, it's a simultaneous cutscene and credits. Alright! Man, the windfish is is a cool design. Why did they never use it again? That seems like an important enough entity to have a, it appear in another game. Even as like an Easter egg. But instead, the only thing it carries over to other games is the song. Which is in that not that many games to begin with either. Um yeah, this link, this specific link, is in Link to the Past, which is the beginning of his story, then this game. Then Oracle of Seasons and Oracle of Ages. So he's in four. What other links are in multiple? Well, Ocarina of Time link is in Majora's Mask. That's the same link. Wind Waker and Phantom Hourglass is the same link. I feel like there's one other one that I'm missing somewhere. I mean, maybe one of the spin-offs, like Link's Crossbow Training, might be the same link as Twilight Princess, if that's even a canon game. Oh, Breath of the Wild and and Tears of the Kingdom. That's the same link. That's the most, like, clearly the same link of all the links. Actually, it's pretty clear that the other one... Well, this one... This one's the only one that's kind of vague. Like, oh, they didn't really confirm it was all the same link until... Probably the Hyrule Historia stuff. Anyways, it seems the credits are just rolling now. There's no scenes. If there's a scene, I'll be back. Oh. Short credits. Rizzo. Show me bird. Show me Marin turning into a bird. Anything? Oh. Okay. Oh, look at you! You're an anime girl!
And now you're an enemy seagull. Another character that should have been in more Zelda games, Marin. I guess Malin is her like spiritual successor, but they're not quite the same character. Oh, yes. Neat. Oh, I got a little star. Seeing the anime intro and outro for this game, I kind of wish there was like a Studio Ghibli-esque Zelda movie, not the live-action one that whatever's being made. Or, it's not live-action, it's probably animated, but... I'm sure it'll be fine. Like the Mario movie, it's gonna be a fine movie, it'll be entertaining. But if there was a Ghibli... Zelda movie? Not, not necessarily Ghibli, there's plenty of other good studios out there, like Studio Trigger would probably make a fantastic one. But like... Come on. Although, Nintendo is making... Didn't they... Isn't that a thing that they have like a movie branch now, or a film, or media, or something like that? I thought that was a thing. Uh, yeah, so I just need to get the last... Oh, there's Bow Wow. Oh, Bow Wow moves a lot. How appropriate. Ooh, that might have been too soon. Bow Wow is the last one. Chow Chow was the first one. Okay, at least it rolls back to the same spot. Alright, stop spinning there, Bow Wow. I need you to stay still. This is the last thing I need to use rupees on. Okay, let's wait until it's all the way over. Now go. Uh. Okay, wait, hold on. Hold on. This is something. Let's see if it stays. Come on, roll forward a little bit. Oh, where are you going, Bow Wow? Quickly, before it rolls away. It's rolling away! Oh, boy. Oh, back on the platform. Okay. So now it's moving to about here. Oh, come on! <laughs> come on with that! It's so rolly. Alright, let me wait a little bit just to see where it kind of settles down. This is the final challenge. Quickly, go, 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 go. Oh, oh, is that... No, that's... Damn it. It has to be, like, perfectly on it. It's, like, just wide enough to get inside the claw. I might have to reset this one, even... If we just roll off to the off the middle area. Oh, why did it move like that? It's, it's grabbing, trying to grab something. Go forward, go forward, go forward, go forward, go forward. Let's see, is that is it forward enough that I'll give it a little nudge. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Why did it move so much? Oh, is that forward enough? Could it be we finally have a spot to settle? Oh, this might be it. Don't you move. Got it. 
don't you sl don't you somehow slip out of this hand? Don't you do it? Okay. Nope. Yeah. Oh well, it's scarily realistic. You got a good eye and a steady hand. In here, that makes you a champ. And here's the lump of rock to prove it. I think it's called a chamber stone. The guy doesn't even know what he's giving me, and he's like, "Oh yeah, this is this is." And listen, no champ pays more than five rupees to go in my establishment. Well, what's the dang point without a new game plus? If I just want to have some fun, I guess. I'm never going in your building again until the next time this game gets remade. Yes. It's a bow a figure. Guaranteed to stay perfectly still. What's the chow chow say? Like a real thing requires a lot of love and a lot of patience. Okay. Oh, Bow Wow, it was nice to see you again after... I don't know, like... 18? 17 years? When did this... the original? No, I didn't play the original, I played the Game Boy Color version. In fact, I didn't even play the Game Boy Color version when it was out, I played it later... I played it on some form of virtual console. I think on the 3DS, so... It hasn't been that long. When did that come out on the 3DS? Uh... I think X and Y was like 2013? No. It wasn't that long ago. 2017? Uh... No, no, it was 2013. Wow. It's been 21 years? No, uh, 21. 11 years since those games came out? Yeah, so it probably has been closer to like 9 years, considering the light, how long the 3DS was around. Still, almost a decade between playing this game. Alright, Dampa, I have the last chamber stone. I think there's 193 total. Oh, rupees. Oh, neat. Oh, monsters. Let's see. Uh, open slot. So I got all the bosses. What was the new one? Because there was... I got one from Amoeba. Oh. Oh, it's that room where you have to, like, throw them from above. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, the Amoeba one gives you this. You get a Shadow Link. I think he just follows you? Yeah, so I did all of these. These each gave 300 rupees, and then I think when you finished them all, he gave you another chamber stone? No, he didn't give you anything. He just said congrats. Right. I remember. Okay. I'm pretty sure that's... Oh, let me... Do some cleanup. How's my inventory look? Oh, it even refilled all my stuff after the final fight. What were these two slots? That must have been temporary items, but the trade quest stuff is here. Oh, one of these is the mushroom. What else? What were other... What was another temporary item? It was... I don't remember. Oh, you know what? It was the leaves. It was, you could get the leaves. The the golden leaves for Prince, whatever his face was. 
I'm Aaron. Thank you for everything, Link. You are the kindest boy I know. One day I made a wish to the windfish. What was the wish it was? No, it's a secret. I think someday you will leave this island. I just know it in my heart. Don't ever forget me. If you do, I'll never forgive you. And then Link promptly for Gore. Because that's... There's not a lot of collision going on in the brain cells in Link's head. It would be cool if after you beat the... I, it's it, You rarely see it in games, but I like when you finish the game and... Assuming there's no reason to have them in the world anymore, but there's no more, like, enemies. Like, they just all disappear. Mushroom. Yeah, so that goes... there. And the leaves were the other thing. I remember. I just wanted to have a complete, as complete an inventory as I could have as I wrap up this game. Well, I don't know why I did that. That's not even the way I wanted to go. So there was no real reward for putting all the figures, was there? Hey, is there something in this tree? Why? You don't even need bombs anywhere in this village. Why was... What? Huh? What? Oh, he's gone. Oh, what about the phone call? Anything cool there? Go for it, you're almost there, I'm pulling for you, by click. Okay, well. Urira doesn't have much else to say besides, hey, go finish the game. This was fun. I don't know why I put it off playing so long. I guess, well, like I explained initially, I'm kind of hesitant with 2D Zeldas, the older ones at least. The more modern ones feel better for directions, but like Link to the Past, I always get lost because I just don't remember the order of things. I don't remember what to check. If I sing with her, will she sing? No, no sing, no song. But I'm I am excited for Echoes of Wisdom. I've seen I keep seeing accidental trailers like start playing, like they'll be in like ads or something, and I have to like look away because I don't want to spoil anything. But now I've seen that there's like a whole bunch of the 3D races are in that game. Like there's Gerudo and. Ocean Zora and stuff like that, but I'm, I'm we're so close to re to the release. It's like what less than a week? About a week? A week ish? No, something like that. But we're close to it, and I would like to go in blind as much as I can because I feel that usually leads to a more enjoyable experience. But yeah, that's it for now. That's it for this series. So thanks for joining me. Come back, I'll the next step up real soon. But until then, bye.